Pablo Gunner here with... Jake Eric, original Flash, coming from Earth 3. That's right. So he might be a little biased in these questions, but we'll see. Which movie did you prefer, Aquaman or Black Panther? Strictly going off of how, of how much I've been a Marvel fan, Black Panther. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. How come? It was a different feel, you know, because, you know, we're so used to the big, the, like, the big namers, like... Captain America, Iron Man, Thor, and it's nice to see, you know, someone that's going to be a new game changer for them to see going forward, you know, take the limelight for once and, you know, show us what, you know, a non-American superhero can do, so. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, it was nice to just have, uh, have a little color in there, you know, have it be different. Some, some rich culture, too, you know, when those drums were going, man, I was just like, I was I in it, man. I love the Wakanda theme music. Oh, it was fantastic in those fight scenes. Oh, for like sure. at first I was like, oh, these fight scenes are too fast paced. And I was like, no, nah, because he's like the Captain America of his Nation. country. Yeah, pretty yeah. much. So I'm like, no, not at all. When I rewatched it, so powerful, man. Such a powerful movie. But when it comes down to it, what do you prefer, Spider-Verse or Infinity War? That's a tricky question because they're both such damn good movies. I mean, Infinity War, a little hashed together at some points, character-wise or storyline-wise, but it was still an awesome movie. It's definitely one of my favorites in MCU. But Spider-Verse, Spider-Verse, I think, is a Spider-Man movie we've been all been waiting for since we were kids. I mean, me personally, I like Spider-Verse better than a live-action Spider-Man movie we've gotten so far, and that's saying a lot because even Spider-Verse was so well done, just the storyline, everything. So. Oh, for sure, man. Just the way everything flowed. The music and the animation, the way they mashed all that in there, right. and Miles' story. If you if you're a Miles fan, boom, this is it. He right. got his moment. And right, and you know, a lot not a lot of people are a fan of Miles, but he definitely you know he's getting his he's working his way up the ranks. Yeah, he's not quite like Peter Parker level, but he definitely deserves to play with the big leagues like Peter and all the others in the Avengers. So yeah, for sure. So which do you think was the best movie of 2018? I'd have to go with Infinity War. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I mean but it was it was epic. If you could be tied, ten year though, lead up. If you could be tied though, it'd be Infinity War and Spider Verse would be tied if you could do do a tie. So, all right, cool, awesome, thank you. Come on.